Oh, here we go, YouTube. It's time to enter the Good Time Club and kick off part 10 of our Bioshock Infinite walkthrough. So to catch you up, we just killed our first handyman. Thing was crazy and I actually jumped onto a roof and it followed me and I jumped down and it kind of like got glitched out up there, so it was a, a fluke on my behalf, but either way, he's dead. Since the other day at the lottery, you're a brute. And in times like this, I could use a brute. What do you want, Fink? My labor unrest is coming to it. <laughs> now, Fitzroy has got the jungle all riled up. A man like me could have use of an old Pinkerton like you. Hmm. Let's find Shen Lin and get the hell out of here. Now! All I ask is that you finish what you started to it. Wouldn't want to disappoint the other applicants. Our first candidate is a veteran of Peking. Now, what's that they say about old soldiers? <laughs> Frankly, my money's on you. Go ahead. He's something of an old hand at handling explosives. Only man <laughs> Lost a limb working with them. <laughs> Yet. Boom. Well, that's certainly one uh, very effective way to take out all those bad guys. Listen, Mr. Pyro, you're gonna have to just stop with the. Yo, don't do that anymore. That's it. Enjoy some shock. Down you go. I mean, the RPG really just like molested those guys. Do it now. Let's uh, run over here, grab some of these health kits. Oh, where are you going? Oh, God, I hate how these guys just like rush up on you. Where did it go? Where did you go? Come on, pop out like right there. Gotcha. There's another one behind me? Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. No, 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 no. Not dying yet, guys. No worry. This is where we run for a little bit, and we get over here while our shield comes up, and we grab these health packs, and then... Got him. Down he goes. Thank you, darling. Boom! Who else wants to come at me? I'm having a great time popping them off. God oh, damn, I can't seem to hit this guy. <laughs> Where'd he go? He was there. Why were you? Doing so much damn damage. Now, enough of the opening acts. Your true rival is an expert with the automata. Wants to replace all our security oh boy. with machines. I'll give the old boy credit. Open it. It would be fewer mouths to feed. <laughs> oh, no. Damn it. Alright, well, I guess I can use this up and then, uh,. Look up here! That'll do! 
Jesus, this isn't going too hot. Um, you know what? We need to... There we go. Shoot other things that aren't us. Oh god, so I can see that that didn't last at all. Well, we're just going to try and take this guy out without dying real fast. Shit. See, now this isn't good because we are basically just like pinned. Nope. Oh man, I might die here. No, I don't want to die here. Shit, I'm getting stuck. No! No, 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 no. No! No, 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 no! No! Fuck me, I died. Booker, get Come on, get me back. Get me back, Elizabeth. You can do it. Where did that automaton go? That's what I gotta take out. Oh man, don't tell me I actually managed to kill him at the last second. I feel like I'm under too much fire. His medkits are still empty. Oh, nope. I feel like you have a lot more health than I remember you having. Great, thanks. Oh man, he's like on top of me. God. Alright, well, we're gonna take his crank gun in just a second. I don't know, honestly, I don't know why I didn't just do that at the start of this fight. Probably would have made everything a lot easier if I just popped off these turrets and then started to deal with the other more annoying turrets. Get our shield back. Down you go. Down you go. Come on, reload. 28 left. We should just go grab that hand cannon. Is that both of them? I'm not interested in your job, Fink. Now, now, I know all about your little job for Fitzroy. But do you really want to take her offer over mine? Do you know how many people would kill to be head of Fink's security? <laughs> You're a tough nut to crack, Mr. DeWitt. A tough nut. <laughs> but I promise you this. I will get what I want. Yeah, whatever you say, buddy. Okay, there's a door over here. I think that's the way down. All right. Well, we got uh, looking good on ammo again. Still a little pissed that I ended up dying there. It was such a. What sucks is it's that it was an avoidable, an avoidable death. If I hadn't taken that last dive out. I probably, I don't know. I mean, I had a lot of shit shooting at me. I think I might have died either way there. Boys only. Oh, let's check. Box of bone. I had thought you a fool, dear brother. When you told me that you heard wonderful music trumpeting from holes in the thin air, I began to doubt your mental integrity. But... Not only have you made your fortune from these doodads, you have lit the path for me as well. Hooker, careful. 
What the? You lack virtue. Get shot. What did she call me? A black virtue? <clears throat> give me your sandwich. And give me your hand cannon ammo, too. Try to shoot me. Teach you a lesson. First gun ammo. What's in here? More ammo. More ammo. What do you see in there? I think there's a lockpick over there. Ooh, there is. Good job, Elizabeth. Oh, that's cool how she like lights it up and it glows blue. It's the first time I've seen her do that. All right, what is this? Chen Lin, Diego. What are all these names and numbers Look, for? Chen Lin, cell number nine. Ah, well that explains it. You want to take a look at this? Pop it on open. I used to work for folks like Fink. Really? Man, I was with the Pinkertons. They call us in when the workers got restless. To do what? Demonstrate the folly of men striking, throwing down tools. You hurt people. I'll tell you this. Sometimes there's precious need for folks like Fitzroy. Why? Because of folks like me. All yours. No, like, you need to stop telling her things like this. Like, that's not going to make her want to come with you anymore. Like, she already doesn't want to go with you. Oh, holy shit. Back up, buddy. I'm really liking this hand cannon thing. I mean, the ammo obviously isn't too high on it, but I think if I uh, upgraded the damage, it might be able to just destroy people. Like, boom, one shot. One shot, one shot. No, can't play the movie. Pistol, nothing else. Tell us what you know about Fitzroy, you goddamn gook. We know you can hear us. You want to say something? Or you want us to bring in Mrs. Lynn for company? Uh, throw a bucket of ice water on him. We got three more to bring in tonight. A bunch of dicks. No pretties down here. He treats them like animals. Oh, you missed. And there goes your head. Switch out the carbine for the machine gun. Five picks. Can you get this open? I'll give it a whirl. What's behind door number eight? An empty corpse. And. Hmm. Excessive damage stuns nearby enemies. Oh. Well, hell yeah, then. So I never really had used the other thing. I'll take a pair of boots. You got a lock here. Oh. I take all your cake. Got it. Do it? You're a lion. But you can't blame me for looking after my own interests, can you? Now I know Fitzroy has come calling. But I think you'll find your business with her. What did he do? Did he just kill Chen or something? <clears throat> Lots of blood. Lots of blood. Wow. This can't be good. Oop. Take our lockpick. Can't see shit in here. Oh, no. 
Is that Mr. Chen? We're too late. God damn it. Oh man. Damn it really fucked him up. Now we need to find someone else to make those guns. No. Dead is dead, Elizabeth. Dead? He's dead. What? Who the fuck? The hell did... I see heads. And I see tails. It's all a matter of perspective. Why are you following us? Who sent you? Comstock? What do you want? What from... do you see here from this angle? Dead. Listen. And that angle? Alive. Walker. Chen Lin. The body's gone. It was never here. It's another Columbia. A different Columbia. The same coin. A different perspective. Heads. Tails. Dead. Alive. We have to go through to this other Columbia, but... <sighs> it's like riding a bicycle. One never really forgets. One just needs the courage to climb aboard. Okay, so, uh... We go into the stairs. Well, I mean, we don't have much else of a choice, so I guess open the tear. Open it. Look, there's no blood. What is a repeater? No it's another world, Booker. Another Columbia. Something tells me one dead gunsmith ain't the only thing that's changed. <laughs> Ah, oh, so this thing just seems like a high-powered machine gun. Kind of like it. Yeah, it looks uh, quite different. Okay, let's uh, see what's going on in this second Columbia. the hell? Stop screaming. Making too much noise. What the hell? Box populate crime board. Oh, I was hoping I'd find like another piece of equipment in the in the other one. <clears throat> wow, they just got like a lot of people uh imprisoned here. You can change something like that and have everything else remain the same. What is this? Vox Anarchist Daisy Fitzroy. Labor Agitator. I killed them. They were dead. Not in this world. So, do I gotta re-kill them? Put you out of your misery. A bitch about a nosebleed. Offer, bro. Oh, 
There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Oh. Yeah, it does. I'm just trying to figure out what the hell's going Catch. on. Thanks. So apparently there's like two dimensions now. And Elizabeth is able to open rifts between them. Beyond that, I have no idea. Might as well add this on for the achievement. 1909. Just about to blimp. Damn it. Still nothing for possession. We gotta make our way back up top to get out of here. Gotta go this way for that. So let's run over here. It's weird as there's no rifts in this world either. Like the stuff that I was able to rift in in the previous world, like the health kits and all that, I figured that would be like waiting right there, but it's not. Gunsmith set free? This one definitely wasn't in the other world. Lives alive. That's uh, it's good for us. So that's all I really care about. Hopefully, I don't gotta fight another one of those uh, those giant dudes. Sweetheart. Oh shit, I like put those on to stuff. I thought it was like a like a launch type deal. Alright, well I'm not trying to sit here and fight these assholes all day. What the hell? What's going on? Are they like hiding behind the horse? Can't quite grab that. Oh man, I was really hoping that wouldn't hit me. You wanna toss me some salts there, sweetheart? Be useful. <laughs> Fuck, why did I do that? That wasn't very smart. Trying to find somebody to get a possession off on. But I'm not seeing anyone that really looks like they'd be worth it. Maybe I could take that guy. Look how they're like going through Elizabeth and she's just like, oh, I'm fine, don't worry about me. This is still blocked off in the other world. Oh god, I'm probably dead here. No, nope, I survived somehow. Nope, oh man. Nope, 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 nope. Oh my god, my shield's coming back. <laughs> okay. 
That was way too close. Down you go. Hoping that taking that guy will help uh, lighten the load from fighting these guys. Thanks, sweetheart. And then, yep, we could definitely use a. Not a big fan of the volley gun, but I'll take it over a gun that doesn't have ammo. Oh, hell yes. Fantastic. Back up, buddy. You know what? The problem here is I'm not using crows. Crows make everything easier to kill. dead um real quick we're gonna see i want to see if the uh, vox populi message is still on the board over here the is a it is yes so we got the code book this time all right give me a second the broken clock tolls at midnight which clock this looks like the one set it to midnight Oh, shit. Man. I gotta make sure I figure out those things from now on. Locksmith bag and fusion and an audio log. I came to Columbia because I believed in God and because I believed in honor. But Slade has shown me this. There is no God in shutting our brothers out from the family of man. And there is no honor in defending those who are strangers to its meaning. Perhaps in Finkton there is one more deserving of my service. Certainly an effective way to take care of that. Anybody else? Nope, no one else shooting at me. Some salts, armory. if that crate like refilled with stuff. Either way, in to see the gunsmith we go. Back to the gun shop. Do you hear anything? Huh? No machines. No tools. Let's go find that gunsmith. Hmm. Maybe he's upstairs now. Yeah, but it's weird that there's nothing here. What the fuck? It's the figure of Comstock now. Mr. Lin? Chen Lin? Excuse me, Chen Lin? Who are you? You speak up! Speak up! Can't hear you over all these machines! Very loud! I'm Booker DeWitt. Stand back! These machines very dangerous. Wait downstairs with Mrs. Lin. Uh, Daisy Fitzroy sent us. We need to talk to you about getting some weapons. Machines very dangerous. No place for stupid people. Want to lose pretty head? Mr. Lin, downstairs! What is wrong with him? Remember him dead in that cell? Maybe in 
In some way, he remembers that too. Huh. How would you reconcile that? I don't know. Kill my husband? Calm his troubled thoughts. It's a white bitch now. Ease his burden. Excuse me, ma'am. I'm looking for Mrs. Lin. I'm Mrs. Lin? No, I, I mean a little Chinese lady. She was... Booker. This is Mrs. Lin. They took Chen's tools. What's he got without his tools? Well, your husband is a bit out of sorts. If he could work again, maybe... If, if he could work, he'd... Mrs. Lin, can you tell me who took your husband's tools? Goddamn police. They took them and locked them up. In the impound in Shantytown. Would having his tools back fix hmm. his mind? Who cares? We're not getting any guns if Chen Lin doesn't have his tools. Let's head to Shantytown. Alright guys, well, looks like up next we're heading to Shantytown. So make sure to tune back in. Help uh, old crazy Chen Lin get his head back on straight and... We'll see you guys on the next part.